at the Kingdom hosting Delphus Jefferson. We see the Knights taking the field, and it's Colin Bailey for the Jeff Cats looking for the open man, and Andrew Miller coming down with it, and he would get the first after fighting for some additional yak on that play. Now it's Bailey again. He's going to connect to Miller again. He's going to be just shy of the first this down. Good pursuit by Crestview there on the ball. Now Bailey looking for the open man and Dalton Castle getting in there for the sack. Now Logan Gerardo gets the handoff from Jaden Ward and we've seen him run so hard so many times. He's going to go all the way for the touchdown. This one puts Crestview on the board first. Now it's Ward. He's going to look find Gerardo again on another drive and He's going to get pushed out of the sideline. He's going to get the first down just about a yard away from that. Now, Gerardo looking to run some more. He'll have some space toward the sideline. Tiptoes and just put out just shy of the goal line there at the six yard line. So now Brody Breck will take the handoff. He runs this one in for a touchdown. Crestview all over the Jeff Cats tonight. Final score in this one, 42 to six. Crestview coming away with the win. Also in the Northwest Conference, Spencerville taking care of Paulding 26 to 20 in a tough matchup. Spencerville clinching the West Division. So with Columbus Grove taking the East Division, this is what your conference championship bracket will look like. Some intriguing matchups. Of course, Spencerville, Ada there at the top. Allen East, Paulding, Grove and Jefferson and Crestview and Bluffton. And we'll be covering those next week here on the Sports Report on WTLW and WOSN.